Yeah. 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 Two chains. What's that on that beat? Oh. I'm different. Yeah, I'm different. I'm different. Yeah, I'm different. I'm di <sighs> Hi, I'm Rihanna. Hi, I'm Steven. And I'm Aaron. And we're going to show you how to set up MIDI and audio equipment to the computer. Okay. First of all, this is a microphone, which is an audio device. You can clearly see. Okay. One end is, is we use the XLR cables to connect the microphone to a mixing desk and to connect it to Logic. One end what goes into the mixing desk is the XLR male. The other other side is the XLR female. You can tell the difference one's got pins and one's got holes. And then cool. you put um, you put the XLR female into the pins on the microphone. And then you put X, the male onto the mixing desk. Put the pins up to the holes on the mixing it's, desk. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's fun. Okay, but with a keyboard, it's slightly different. You use a USB, USB cable to connect it to the computer. But if you want to connect it to a stereo, you, mm. connect, you connect it with an RCA cable. Okay. Oh, it's already open, actually. Don't say. Okay. Why don't you click on the logic icon? It should yeah. open up. But we've only got it open to get a file. Then just open. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Okay. Empty project. Okay, once once you open it, a box will pop up. You're going to have to select whether you're going to use a software instrument or audio instrument and the number of tracks you want yes. to use. Yes. So, first off, we're going to choose software instrument software. and create. Yes. This can be changed anytime by adding yes. or deleting a track. When using MIDI and you want to change the output from your input device, you use the library and there's a variety of different instruments, software instruments you can choose from. Okay. Using an audio device like a microphone, such as one can was using, the signal travels to the mixing desk, which is on the desk, then to the audio track on Logic, which is there. Changing the output on MIDI, you go to the library on Logic. To change the sound and pick the instrument you want. Go to file and save as to save your work in the area of your choice. Goodbye. Goodbye.